hi guys this is your girl Janwell and welcome back to my channel so it's been a while I haven't made a video it's about two weeks now but having a nine to five job is not easy so today what we are making we're making a banana ice cream simple recipe three ingredients very easy to make so I'm going to be using some Bananas. I have two bananas here that I slice up and put it in the freezer. So you can put it in the freezer for two hours if you want to make your banana ice cream. But I have this in the freezer already. I use them to make smoothie and stuff. So I'm going to use this today to bake some ice cream. So let's start making our ice cream. So I have some heavy whipping cream here for my ice cream. I'm going to use a cup of heavy whipping cream and I'm going to use half of that kind of condensed milk just half a cup of condensed milk because the banana has sugar in it so I'm gonna start with my frozen bananas as I said you want to freeze your bananas for about two hours if you are just gonna make your ice cream two hours is enough to make it so I'm gonna put my bananas right here in this food processor Um, you want it to make things kind of a you want it in a puree so that's what I'm gonna do okay at that that's a nice puree so I'm gonna put this in a bowl now look at how smooth that is nice and creamy so you're gonna have a nice ice cream So now I'm going to add some condensed milk to this. I'm going to add half a cup of condensed milk. So why I'm going to use only half a cup. I have one cup here and that's half a cup. So I'm going to use half a cup of condensed milk. Because the banana is sweet. That's why. That's why I'm going to only use half a cup. Of condensed milk. I'm gonna put it right here. So. Now you just want to mix everything together. Very easy recipe. Because you don't want it too sweet. So I'm going just going to set this aside. I'm going to put it in the fridge in the meanwhile and we're going to whip our cream. Yes, we're going to whip some heavy cream. Okay, so I'm going to set this aside. So I have some heavy cream here, heavy whipping cream. So I'm going to use a cup of this I did use a half a cup of condensed milk and two bananas you want to slice it nicely and put it in the fridge for about two hours so I'm going to use just one cup of heavy cream you want your your cream nice and cold you want to put it in the fridge before you use it or put it in the freezer like five minutes before using it so it can be nice and cold so I'm going to use my hand mixer to whip the cream if 
you want it nice and stiff. So that is what we're looking for, guys. Look at that. That is exactly what we're looking for. So now what you want to do, you want to put your cream in this mixture right here. Banana and condensed milk mixture. So I'm going to put a little bit of cream first. You see all this ice cream you can get out of one cup of whipping cream, two bananas, and half a cup of condensed milk. That depends on your measuring cup. Everybody has a different measuring cup. My measuring cups are not that big, and look at all what I got from it. For me, that's a cup, and that is half a cup. See, a cup and half a cup. It's all nice and fluffy. So you can use all the the whipping cream if you want to because mine had like I had a like a 500 milliliters that's how you say it guys 500 milliliters of whipping cream so it's like you give it's like a cup and a half or something I guess but I just use half not half I use one cup of whipping cream Half a cup of condensed milk and two bananas, ripe bananas. If you have bananas in your freezer already, you can just use it. If you don't have bananas in your freezer and you buy your bananas, you can just cut it in slices and put it in the freezer for about two hours and you're good to go. Look at this. And that's it. Our ice cream is ready. You still want to mix it up because you can see the the brown in it still so the ice cream is ready simple as this quick and easy ice cream you can make ice cream for your kids well the next time I'm gonna make ice cream I'm gonna make a mango ice cream I love mangoes and mangoes are in season right now so you can do that so I'm gonna put my ice cream in a container I think I need to don't have a lot I gotta go in there up a little bit oh it's not gonna take the rest I'm gonna put it in something else so look at that look at the texture nice and creamy so you want to cover this tight And I'm going to put it in the freezer for about eight hours. Eight hours. And after eight hours, I'm going to show you guys. Or tomorrow, I'm going to show you guys the finished product. How it's looking. I have a little bit left. I'm going to put it in something. Half 
this little tiny container. I'm going to see if it's going to put it in there. Okay. That is it. Cover it. And we're going to pop it in the fridge for about eight hours. So after eight hours, I'm going to show you guys how it's looking. So we are back with our ice cream, banana ice with my banana ice cream. So it's been about eight hours since I put this in the freezer. So that's gonna so we're gonna check it out. Look at that beauty. Look at that. Look at that. Eight hours. So now we're gonna scoop into it. Let's see what's going on. Yeah, so I have my little glass here. I'm gonna put a few scoops in there. Let's see what's going on. Mmm. So you can leave your ice cream overnight if you want to. You don't have to leave it. Eight hours if you don't want to, you can leave it overnight. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that beauty. Look at that. So this is the ice cream. My son is going to test it. He cannot wait. So guys, this is the finished product. If you like the video, subscribe to the channel. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one.